night five of my tea advent calendars. Let's see what we've got. From Sip Spy, we have the Davidson's Organics Herbal tea, Herbal Christmas Tea. And from T2, we have a Green Rose. Let's see what we have from Badal. Here is night five of Badal's tea advent calendar. And it is Earl Grey Citrus Black Tea. I love Earl Grey, so I'm excited to try this one. Everything has been brewed up. It's time to give them a taste. First up, we have Davidson's Organics Herbal Christmas Tea. A delightful caffeine-free blend of full-bodied herbs and seasonal spices. Organic and caffeine-free. This one was from the Sip Spy calendar. Caffeine-free holiday tradition. Organic herbal Christmas tea over the years has become synonymous with holiday activities and good cheer. The magic combination of complex herbs, aromatic mint, and seasonal spices elegantly captures the essence of the season. The holiday season is a communion of feeling. When good friends come together at the right moment under the best conditions, our festive, caffeine-free blend is the perfect accompaniment to this special time of coming together. Ingredients, organic cinnamon, organic peppermint, organic orange peel, organic cloves, organic nutmeg, and natural flavor. It smells really good. You can smell the cinnamon and the peppermint. Kind of reminds me of toothpaste. Here is the tea brewed up. Tea smells good. I'm definitely getting the cinnamon. It's a sweet cinnamon. A little bit of the mint there at the tail end. It's pretty good. I mean, I'm not crazy about it, but I'll finish this. It's not bad. Then our second tea is from the a T2 calendar. On the front, it says, a day filled with tea is a good day indeed. This tea is green rose, vibrant green tea blended with rose petals and tropical fruits for a bold taste sensation. Great as an afternoon tea and blooming beautiful iced in summer. Ingredients, green tea, currants, mango bits, natural and artificial flavoring, rose petals, and cornflower petals. Here is that tea smells fruity, that tropical fruity smell. Mm, not feeling this one. Probably because I'm not crazy about mango. It's got that tr tropical fruity thing going on, but not, not in the way I like. But again, I don't care for mango. And that's one of the, that's the big fruit in that one. And our last tea is from Vadam. Here's the little canister. Earl Grey Citrus Black Tea. I brewed that up as a latte because that's how I like my Earl Greys. It smells like an Earl Grey. You have that citrusy bergamot smell. Not bad. I probably should have added a little more tea. It's a little weak, but I think I should have put some more tea in there when I steeped it. That is it for tonight's tea advent teas. I will have three more tomorrow for day six. So don't forget to like and subscribe to come back and see the next batch of teas. Thanks. Bye.